welcome, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome if you're new here, welcome back if you've been here before, please hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell on, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, share if you care, this haul is like a random dive of a few retail stores what is it burlington coat factory pet smart big lots dollar tree and bed bath and beyond we only found a few things at each store but they all add up and we're gonna get right into it to it we're gonna start over here. Um, I'll do Pet Smart. Um, I'm pretty sure this was a return, but I thought it was a cute little uh, um, dog harness. It has a cute little pocket. Look at that little pocket right there. Look at it. I don't know what you put. Oh, put maybe put his poop poop bags in there. That's cute. But then there was this parakeet food my um a friend of mine has a parakeet two parakeets actually so i'm pretty sure she could use this it was a return also at first i thought it was not open and i'm like why is it only quarter of a bag left but it, it was open it has that zip thing there so but i'm sure she could still use it this little dog toy and a whole thing of ugh. I can't even lift it. <laughs> cat litter. How many pounds is that? Nine pounds of cat litter was not destroyed, not open, nothing. So I'm pretty. And then look, if y'all remember, why can't you just throw the stuff in the trash and mark out the um, tag? Sure is. I said it. There it is. I mean, just do that. Don't destroy the stuff. You don't have to. Just let us get it out the dumpster if you think it's trash. But, okay. I'm going to get off my, uh, what do you call that? My, I'm going to get off my high hook and I can't. Um, anyway. <laughs> um, burning too. Oh, no, this is one more thing. This is, a uh, what do you call this thing? Something you put in the fish tank, like a backdrop for the fish tank. Here it is. Wood and seagrass. Reversible aquarium background. So that is in there. We do have that fish tank, but it's small. We would probably have to cut this. And I think the backdrop on that is cool for the fish anyway. I have a larger fish tank to sell, so I'll just throw that in there with it. But anyway, Burlington, Burlington. Only found I got a couple things out of Burlington. This Echo Unlimited Belt. This Van Heusen shirt, which is pretty dirty, still has the security tag on it. Suggested retail price of $50. I'm going to wash that up. And then all of these bags. Brand new bags. That the last time I found bags was at Five Below. They had just thrown like, cases of bags out. But here Burlington is doing the same thing. And so I just grabbed them up because these will be perfect for the flea market. Uh, put them along with the bags I already have. And I should have enough bags for the season. Um, let's do Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree had all of these glow sticks. And funny enough, cards. But these are money gift card holders. So... Two packs of those, eight in each pack, and then <laughs> Valentine's cards. So there's only a few. They had a a giant box of um the envelopes, but they I never see the cards in that particular Dollar Tree. Never seen the cards, so only a, a couple cards slip past them. So two Valentine cards, but then one. Uh, I guess that is a Valentine card. So three Valentine cards. Um, but it was a whole box of the envelopes. I don't know what they do with the cards. Maybe they throw them out at a different time. I don't know. But all of these, <clears throat> excuse me, glow sticks. So 
this kind of glow stick, this glow stick, and then just like a variety pack in different colors. And then these longer, oh, these are the bracelets, glow stick bracelets, a few packs of those. And then these glow sticks are the glow stick flag. So I'm assuming these were for Memorial Day, but they can be used for, um, 4th of July. So, um, and these glow, glow stick wands. Yeah, these can be used for the 4th of July. So, I'll put those out at the flea market and we'll see what those do. And then, is that it for Dollar Tree? I think so. So, we'll go to Dollar General. It's just this little makeup brush set. Some adhesive hooks. A little ball. And two... Um, air fresheners and then this little peanuts what is this bobble bobblehead little peanuts bobblehead oh this sign that says always be humble and kind and then a pack of socks um, size 6 to 10 men's a pair of Christmas socks and this bath set, four-piece bath set, shower curtain, toothbrush, soap pump, and roller hooks. What do you mean roller hooks? Oh, I guess those. Okay. Then we'll do big lots. Let me move this box out of the way. <clears throat> Sorry, y'all. Um, these curtains, they need to be washed. So, two, oh, this is one panel. Mm, I've never seen it. One Tulsa panel. Wow. All right. I was going to, my husband said we should change those out and use these, but I guess not because there's only one. But that was that. It was originally $20 clearance to $14. Um, and then these nice pillows. I was going to get this rug that I had that matches these pillows perfectly. Let me stop this video and get this rug. Okay, finishing up Big Lots. There were these white soft pillows. Two of them. And two microfiber um, teal pillows. I don't, I'm, I'm, they might have been a return. The white pillows were 15. This one doesn't, that doesn't say how much the micro suede pillows were, but they were in a big lots, white big lots shopping bag. So that's why I was I'm assuming they might have been a return. I'm going to do Bed Bath and Beyond. There were these shower curtain hooks. It's six of them. One is somewhere probably in my car or in that box. But I thought those were cute shower curtain hooks. And then this clock, atomic clock. And I just noticed that pull the plastic off and then it's only a little bit of spray paint there. And I'm pretty sure I can clean that off. And the same with this. Pull it off and no more spray paint except for right there. And I'm sure I can clean that off. So it's not as bad as it looks. Which is good. And then. This clock. Yes. They spray painted it. Um, But all the numbers are there. This is. I want to say. Some type of metal. So all the numbers are there. And the hands are there. It does take a battery. There is no battery in it. But I asked my husband where I could do it, but I have so much to do. I asked him to um, paint it, just paint it, maybe black. But I wonder if you could paint it another color, paint that use some tan paint like it was already like a distressed tan and repaint it. 
because I think that's a nice big clock. Um, so yeah, I thought that was a good find. Nothing is wrong with it other than it's spray painted, which can be taken care of. So that was it for Bed Bath & Beyond. But I'm going to show you a little bit of decor. So, these are the white pillows that I just found in um, Big Lots. And this white throw is something that I found. I think I found this at Five Below recently. And this rug that I have been saving that I found at Bed Bath & Beyond. Brand new rug. Still with the tag on it. I just thought it was so nice. Look how thick and fluffy this rug is. Oh my goodness. Nice, 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 nice. Now, I was like, if I had a glam room, these items would be in my glam room. These are some glasses that I found at um, a previous find that I found at Burlington. I want to say it was a set of three. One of them was broken. But if I had a glam room, these items would be in my glam room. I would have a chase lounge, have my throw and my pillows on there, and have my rug in front of it. Have somewhere where my um, bling glasses were on there. And I think that would be really cute. I'm, I love home decor. I love decorating. Um, so this was just an idea. My spare room I've made into my grandkids' room. But if I were to make myself a glam room, I would probably add some items like these. This is a nice fluffy throw in the rug and the pillows. These pillows just gave me that idea of, oh, I have these items I can put together or whatever. So I use, um, I do like little displays at the flea market and set up little items like this just to give people an idea of some things to do. And they seem to sell pretty well. So just an idea. Um, but that is the end of this haul. Thank you for watching. And if you have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. Uh, <laughs> that is all. See y'all on the next dive.